Hi everyone, welcome to this tutorial. AppGeeker right here, and today we're going to show you how to record your computer screen through a couple of easy ways. Screen recording can be really useful for creating video tutorials, sharing gameplay, or even recording online meetings. In this video, we're going to show you how to screen record on both Windows and Mac computers. We'll be using the built-in tool on your computer as well as alternative tool that makes screen recording quick and easy. So whether you're a Windows or Mac user, you'll be able to follow along with this tutorial and start recording your computer screen in no time. Alright, let's start with Windows. If your computer is running Windows 10 or Windows 11, you have a built-in tool called the Xbox Game Bar that lets you record your screen for free. First, you're going to make sure the Xbox Game Bar is enabled on your computer. To do this, you can open the Start menu on your Windows desktop and search for Xbox Game Bar. Then click on the app in the search results. And if it's not already enabled, you may need to go to the Settings and select the Gaming option. Under it, click the Xbox Game Bar and then toggle the switch to turn it on. Well, now, you're able to start your screen recording. But before that, it's important to note that the game bar is only capable of recording one single window at a time. So make sure not to switch to a different window while recording, or the recording process ends itself. Alright, now, open the app or window that you want to record. Then, simply press the Windows key plus G on your keyboard. You should see a small menu pop up on your screen. Keep in mind that don't start it from your desktop or file explorer as the game bar doesn't have the ability to capture them. Then click on the capture button right here. This will open the capture menu. From here, you can choose whether to take a screenshot or record the app running on your computer screen. As you can see, here's also a microphone button. You can use it as well if you want to record audio and video along with your Windows screen. OK, once ready, click on the record button to start the screen recording. It will capture everything on your current window or app. When you want to stop the recording, just click the stop button on the floating bar. It's going to tell you that the game clip recorded. Hit the message and your screen recording will be saved as an MP4 file in the captures folder in your videos library. You can access all your screen recordings there for later reference. That's it. With these simple steps, you can use the Xbox Game Bar to quickly and easily record your screen on a Windows computer. However, like I said, the Xbox Game Bar is unable to record the File Explorer or your Windows desktop. If you start recording on your computer desktop or File Explorer, you'll get a black screen instead. But don't worry. We'll show you another quick tool that helps you to record your computer screen with just a few clicks. The next screen recording tool I'm going to show you is the Screen Recorder from AppGeeker. It's a very efficient tool that can be used on both Windows and Mac OS, and it's able to record everything on your computer screen with adjustable resolutions and audio sources. So, no matter what you want to record on your Windows PC or Mac, it can basically meet all your needs. Alright, if you're interested about it, simply click the link below this video to know more. There are more advanced features waiting for you to explore. And now, let's see how efficient the screen recorder is. First, open it on the desktop. And from its welcome interface, we've got several different recording options. For screen recording, select the video recorder mode. Ok, as you can see, here we've got more options. We can click on Full to record the entire screen, or click on Custom to choose a specific recording are on the screen. You can also toggle on the webcam and microphone switches to add your webcam overlay and external narrations. And from the gear icon here, you have the options to decide the video quality and output formats, hotkeys and more, all based on your requirements. Alright then, when everything's set up, simply click the Rec button and the screen recording process begins now. And not just that, here, I'm going to show you one of its best features. When you start your recording, you'll see this status bar on the screen. Through it, you can hide the toolbar or pause your recording as you want. 
but most importantly, it offers an editor feature letting you add drawings, arrows, texts, and other on-screen annotations while recording. See? It turns your computer screen into a notepad and allows you to record everything you need, very convenient. And when you're done, just hit the red stop square here. Here, the preview window pops up, so you can watch your recording or trim the video to remove the unwanted part. After that, feel free to export your recordings in your preferred format and save it to a local folder on your computer. It's very powerful and pretty easy to use for all levels of users. So, why hesitate? Click the link below and give it a try. All right, now you know how to record your computer screen in two efficient ways. If you found this video helpful, please give a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more tech tutorials like this. Thanks for watching.